Widespread dense fog continues to be an issue around all of eastern Nebraska and most of western Iowa this morning. Again, in the Omaha metro, it's uh, been around Bellevue, around Papillion, La Vista, Ralston, over toward Wahoo and toward Fremont as well. But you see quarter mile visibility in Lincoln, Tacoma, Harlan and Maryville right now. Temperatures upper 30s and low 40s, so make sure you slow down out there, add a little more time to your morning drive because the fog is going to be pretty thick for the next few hours. It's not until about 10 o'clock where it really starts to thin out. Clouds start to decrease around the middle of the day. A split in temperatures off to our west where the sun comes out a little bit earlier will be in the mid 60s by noon, upper 50s in the metro and into western Iowa, so you'll want to keep that jacket or a sweatshirt with you through the middle of the day. Then this afternoon, south winds pick up. All that sun comes in here. Look at the temperatures. Upper 60s in Iowa, low 70s in eastern Nebraska, mid 70s as you head farther to the west. And we're going to keep warming up. South southwest winds pick up even more this evening. Blustery as some football playoffs start tonight. And it's going to be warm. Temperatures in the upper 50s and low 60s. And then we keep those strong south southwest winds tomorrow. We'll probably have some high and mid-level clouds, kind of a filtered sunshine look. And football games tomorrow starting off with temperatures in the upper 70s in the evening. Very warm for playoff football around here. A little bit cooler if you're going to Camp Randall in Madison on Saturday for the game. Kickoff temperatures around 60 degrees, but most of the game is going to be spent in the 50s. And second half rain showers are possible. So it looks like it's going to get a little slippery and a little cool there up in Wisconsin. Here in Nebraska and Iowa, temperatures in the low to mid 70s today. 80 degrees tomorrow, down to the low 70s with just a few more clouds around on Saturday. Look at Halloween, 80 degrees, windy and dry. We don't even bring rain in the forecast until later on Wednesday afternoon.